Hello everyone and welcome. This is actually take two because something was busted on my uh, camera and apparently I did the video at a quarter speed, which also didn't record my voice. So um, I couldn't actually, you know, like speed it up in editing or anything like that. But these things happen, right? To like only me. Anyway, uh, why am I not, you know, like painting or um, other stuff is because uh, I tried to get like the brag video out because I promised you I've been working on him and I have been, I have been, I've, I've not been slacking. See, he, he's done, I don't know if you can clearly see, but uh, yeah, his cloak is actually painted and I tried to do something really cool with like uh, glazes and shades and just use like a shade for a base coat and I'm gonna try and make uh, glazes to give the camel pattern it's, it's gonna be cool I promise promise it's gonna be awesome but 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 the problem with these hobby videos is that unlike the house where uh, regardless if I'm feeling well or not or like you know in the mood uh, I have to work um, these kind of videos if you're not in the mood i'm gonna make mistakes and it's just gonna be a chore and i have to be in the right state of mind be relaxed and have patience while doing them so i don't want to rush them besides that the gaunt's ghosts are some of my favorite characters in like the whole warhammer 40k universe so i really really want to do them justice and i don't have like the best painting skills so I really want to take my time with them and make sure that they are just absolutely fine. All right. Uh, so as an update, um, I'm trying to uh, get at least one uh, hobby related video per week. And while working on the house is quite easy because you just put the camera there, uh, do your work, uh, come back and text-based video with the uh, uh, raw footage which roughly takes about one hour to two hours per video uh, making one of these takes quite a lot more time I have to go manually through all of the footage and edit it to make sure that I cut out all of the uh, parts where the all the frames where the miniatures uh, held outside of the frame because I can't really keep the same uh, position while painting or when it's out of focus and uh, then I have to uh, edit all of that, cut it, then I have to do the voiceovers for that, uh, then I have to do the final shots, the ending, the pictures, edit those in and then render the video which is a process which takes significantly longer than just uh, text-based editing. And just doing the voiceovers, it has to be done in like real time. So once the video is edited, I have to literally talk over that. Now, I would have been able to do this uh, during my um, earlier years but since the kids have come into our lives which i'm not resenting or anything but uh, the space has been reduced drastically as i have to uh share my studio <laughs> slash living room slash uh everything else uh bedroom for me and my wife and i cannot spend my nights as freely as i could because even the pc makes a lot of noise while rendering or even just typing can make noise it's not very comfortable for a person sleeping so that being said even painting you brush your or you when you i wash the brush it clinks and it's nasty so i can't really have the same amount of time i'm not complaining it's just a fact of life i'm hard at work on the house trying to get my own studio back <laughs> so that is in the books and having like uh, being able to have my own room where I can uh, retire for the night and just paint away. I sleep very little. <laughs> I have a very, very uh, weird schedule when it comes to sleep and um, I manage. But yeah, it's good. But as long as I can uh, be in a room. 
that being said, like I said, I'm trying to put out at least one hobby related video a week. And while this might not exactly fit in the niche, I remind you that yes, I, whoop, it, it wouldn't be a video if I don't drop something, right? It wouldn't be one of my videos. Honestly, on the, on the first try, I didn't actually drop anything. God damn it. Uh, I have been hard at work, like I said, uh, painting and trying something. I know you can't really see it very well, but yes, he's painting his cloak is a shade of green. And uh, I'm going to work on uh, gradually increasing the uh, saturation and some uh, weathering effects as well as some mud effects on it. I'm really, really, really hoping that it's going to be awesome because again i think i'm getting the hang of glazes and shades and so on and so forth really getting the hang not just you know giving some shadows here and there in the recesses i'm talking about adding progressive layers on top of the next one's transparent to give it a different kind of uh, look right uh what's in the plan for future because i also wanted to mention that I'm trying to set it up so that I can do like a 24 hour challenge where I try to paint all of my tyranids in one go and see where that ends up and if I'm really comfortable with it like a tabletop quality stuff not God's Ghost called those I got I want to make like display pieces on like their own um, box with lights and stuff or like and uh, probably some scenery I'm hoping maybe fingers crossed uh, i'm seeing what i can do and um uh, also a little spoiler uh i mentioned this like on an instagram post somewhere sometime um i'm hoping that after i finish these guys somewhere down the line in the future i'll be able to kit bash like uh the full uh 12 uh, man get on team which uh, taking into consideration that I have six God's Ghost models and like two of them are not part of that. I have to make like eight other miniatures. So it's going to be mm, difficult, but we'll, we'll see when we get to that point. I'm again getting ahead of myself, but these are dreams and I like to dream. Right, so what can you do if you want to help me keep this uh, hobby side of the channel going? Please share subscribe and like you know as you as i always ask you to do and hopefully i can uh reach uh, 500 subscribers and i can push for uh, a little bit more uh, of my time towards uh, this endeavor as well as hopefully uh have that painting room and studio set up and i can work on that on these side of things a bit all right, with that, I bid you adieu and uh, I'll see you in the next one, hopefully with an actual painting video. Fingers crossed. All right, bye-bye.